The progress bar is a block that you add to the side of your course. It's a neat little feature that you can use to indicate clearly what items need to be completed for the day or for the week or for the session. If the color of the item is green then it means it's completed, if it's red it means it's late and if it's blue it means it still needs to be completed. Teachers also get an overview. At a quick glance the teacher gets an idea of how many of those items were actually completed and quickly check alarm bells like this one over here whether the student was actually present on that day. And if someone who was there didn't complete anything I can hover over the actual item and check what the item was and either follow up or just take note. But I think the best feature of this is that students can clearly see how far they've got to go. To add one of these you just turn your editing on then you go down to the bottom left and click add a block progress bar it will then appear in the bottom left then you set it up using the little pen and basically go through each item that you want to do in that lesson the ones you want on the progress bar you make yes I usually use the day after the actual task and I use the time just to position the item on the bar. So 1 o'clock is the first item, this would be the second item and so on. The type of action will depend on the activity. I usually go for the first one. The second one is activity completion which I already have covered with the activity completion side of things. This I see as just a quick check on progress. So once you've finished go to the bottom, save changes then click and drag it to the top right. So I can see I personally have already finished three of these and I've still got one to do.